I'm standing at one municipal plaza. I came down here because the police chief told me that we can meet in regards to quality of life issues and youth programs in Asbury Park. This is evidence that I'm down here and this is evidence that we did not meet. Good evening and welcome to Asbury Radio. You're on the air. Get the recreation. Right, and not, not so much recreation. Oh, entrepreneurial programs. I mean, there's, uh, no, there's numerous of things that could um that could be taken, excuse me, transpired in Asbury Park. So a lot of people in Asbury Park would like to have um, community talk forums with the police department so that they can know who's who in the community. That you know, when they're on trial, but it's like we, we don't get any answers back. You know. Well, you're gonna get one right now. I think. I think DC Kinman wants to give you an answer here. Yeah. I think I would love to respond. There was a lot of kids in the area, and there still is. Right. But we dealt with the crime first, Correct. and we started removing that problem. Now, uh, one of the other things that we started to do in terms of uh, community relations and uh, speaking with the public and different groups in town, as well as uh, starting recreational programs, Correct. we made that a priority also. And we've been talking to a lot of different groups. As a matter of fact, uh, we spoke with the Homeowners Association Tuesday night. Uh, the previous week, we spoke with several different groups, and uh, I was joking that it was very appropriate that we spoke to the homeowners. Group. You know, just if I could ease your mind a little bit more in, in, uh, with respect to the recreational programs and working with the kids in town, we have really, really started uh, just uh, attacking that uh, day and night. We are looking at, uh, we have started, restarted our uh, PAL, our, our Police Athletic League program. Correct, correct. We are looking at uh, spending some time at the Westside Community Center and uh, having the cops and, uh, interact with all of the kids in town. Okay. We are looking at a lot of different issues. Uh, There's also the boxing. How about, um, um, how about um, dealing with anything with the urban youth as far as um, hip-hop empowerment, where um, state officials are starting to um, take notice and be involved in other police officials, maybe in, um, other, uh, excuse me, in other cities such as Northern Jersey are starting to be involved, where they are controlling what's going on in the hip-hop community because they're involved in such. Right. I mean, is there any such way like where well, we can come together where I can show you documentaries on, um, you know, on positive things and um, whereas other police officials and like I said in other um, states and different cities and communities are being involved with the hip hop, um, you know, with right. the hip hop youth in their community. So one day I would like to sit down with you guys and show you some documentaries on such whereas you guys can get involved and maybe we can probably network together or I can possibly be a liaison. Um, you know, for the youth. Um, I had programs in the past. One was called Urban Success and the other one was called Step for the Future. Step stood for um, students to get um, entrepreneurial paths for the future. We you know? are open to any suggestions and uh, we welcome your input. We, you know, we're ready to lean on anybody that's available to us. It's a, it's a very exciting time, uh, not just for the city, but the, the police department especially. We have a lot of things going on there and just a lot of positive feedback coming in and uh, so many people that are willing to contribute, and, and we're just so thankful for that. And we're very fortunate to be in this position. Okay. And, uh, you know, like I said, we're open to any suggestions, any input you have that might help with, uh, you know, our relations with the kids and any programs available. You know, basically, we can probably try to get things going as soon as possible. Right. If we can all come together. I mean, I'm, I'm always available for stuff to, um, you know, have about the youth in the community. Well, one thing about the police right. department, you always know where to find us. Right. So right. You come on down anytime. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Just do like I do. Keep calling. That's right. That's right. That's oh, it. Believe me, you know, I'm down here. I can pretty much tell you that one. That's it. Thank Don't you. Don't give up. Well, right, thank you very much.